Good morning from the greenhouse. You get me at my finest this morning. Um, I have just barely had a cup of coffee, but I wanted to come share something really cool. So I just put this baby up here. So this is a pineapple top that I planted. Um, after I cut the pineapple up, um, I guess it's been probably about three weeks now. And it is doing absolutely amazing. I'm going to show you. So basically, well, the next time I do one, I'll show you how. But you just twist the top off of the pineapple. And then you peel off like maybe three layers of the um, leaves towards where closer to where the actual body of the pineapple was. And then look, as long as you can keep the center continuing to produce, you have successfully transplanted and are growing your own pineapple. So this will be mainly staying here in the greenhouse to provide the um, the atmosphere it needs to thrive. And I'm gonna show you, actually, let me take my glasses back off, so. Um, okay, so again, look at the center, see how green it is, and it's still developing new leaves, right? And it's fine that the the outer leaves are turning brown. It, as long as the center leaves are still producing, you're good to go. But let me show you something. Here's a fail. Um, but I believe that I caught this one. It was close to not being a good pineapple when I cut it up. So um, here you go. Look at a fail. The interior is absolutely brown. And I don't know why I'm continuing to water it, but I guess I'm just hoping that it might survive. But um, we'll see. And then I have a third one down here. And it's iffy. It is iffy. Again, this was done at the same time as that other one. The successful one, I I was able to get it at a um at a really good uh state before I actually planted it. So we might actually be growing our own pineapple in zone 7B. How about that? All right, until next time, we'll see you back here next video.